I'm a bitch. Yo guys what is going on it's Luki here and welcome back to another video in today's video I'm going to be focusing on the Daemon 3XB it is a relatively new SMG in Black Ops 4 it came out a few updates ago in the black market tiers and the only way to get it now is actually through the reserve crates but anyway I'm going to be focusing on it in today's video giving you guys the best class up and giving you guys some tips and tricks and just why this weapon is one of the best weapons in the game so before I do get into today's video, if you do enjoy it, make sure to go ahead and drop a sub and a like. I do really, really appreciate it. I'm trying to hit 20,000 subscribers before the end of Black Ops 4. So if anyone is new to this channel, make sure to go ahead and turn on those notifications and of course hit that sub button. I do really, really appreciate it. But without further ado, let's just get into why this is one of the best weapons. So like I said before, this weapon is a new kind of DLC weapon. It's relatively new, it came out a few updates ago, and the only way to get it at the moment is only through reserve crates, because basically it was in the black market tiers, it was the very last one I believe, or like the 20th one or something, and only a few people have got it, so obviously not many people are going to have this weapon. Um, now I wasn't sure if I was going to make a video on this weapon just because I don't know how many people of you guys actually have this weapon so I don't know if any of you guys are going to be interested in a bless, best class up video for this weapon uh, just because I don't really know if any of you guys have it because unfortunately like I said before the only way to get out at the moment is through reserve gates uh, or if you already got it from the black market tiers but anyway as you can see this is the class up I use on screen I like to use elo sight, um, high caliber 1, fast mags, steady grip and rapid fire now steady grip is kind of needed on this weapon because the kick on it is quite a lot to be fair the kick on this weapon is quite a lot it is a pretty fast fire rate weapon um and also i do like to use elo sight but sometimes i do use reflex sight and also this last sight here the compact scope trust me it might sound stupid but give this a go once you get to level 13 with this weapon give it this uh, scope a go and it actually makes the accuracy like insane. I don't know what it is, but it makes the accuracy incredibly good with this weapon. And this weapon does need to have good accuracy to be fair. The accuracy isn't too great with this weapon. So you do have to be good at controlling recoil and you do have to have a good accuracy to use this weapon. Um, but obviously steady grip will help you with that if you aren't as good with the accuracy because it does have quite a big kick on it, like I said before. And steady grip does really, really help you with controlling the recoil controlling the kick and just controlling the weapon completely and it'll trust me it will make you use this weapon a ton better and you guys will notice that it is a lot easier to use with a steady grip anyway as you can see i'm going to quickly go over the perks i, I use scavenger and lightweight uh, scavenger is a must have for me because i get a lot of kills and i need more ammo and then lightweight just so i can get around the map faster and i just want to touch on the fire rate quickly as you can see here um, without fire rate, it's only two bars away from the maximum fire rate and with rapid fire It's only one bar away. If you look at the Spitfire, it actually has a faster fire rate than the Spitfire Believe it or not, it actually has a faster rate than the Spitfire I believe this Daemon might be the fastest fire rate weapon in the game Except from when you put the Spitfire with wildfire as you can see if you put the operator mod on Spitfire, it does give it the maximum fire rate. But anyway, like the base ver variant, as you can see, with no attachments, as you can see there, it's actually got a faster fire rate than the Spitfire without the operator mod, which is pretty impressive. Now, I, I love the Spitfire for that reason, because it has an insane fire rate. And it is extremely, extremely good on smaller maps such as Nuketown and stuff like that because obviously when you are in close quarter um, fights, having a, an SMG or a gun 
with a very fast fire rate is going to help you out tremendously just because you're going to be getting out so many bullets per second more than the enemy and you're going to be able to absolutely dominate with this weapon and trust me this weapon absolutely shreds like i've been noticing with this weapon it does have a very very fast kill um like kill time you i do seem to kill people very very quickly with this weapon and the reason for that is because it has got an insanely fast fire rate as you can see there there's an example there that guy actually shot me first like he probably got about three bullets on me before i started shooting him and i managed to kill him that guy there i literally killed him within two bullets that guy there literally i can kill people so fast with this weapon trust me give it a go as you saw there i got about five kills really really quickly and here's another example as well that guy shoot, shot me first and i managed to actually kill him before he killed me so if you guys do have this weapon then i definitely recommend you guys giving it a go like i said before if you guys do not know how to get this weapon unfortunately if you guys did not get it out of the black market tiers from a few updates ago you guys will not be able to get it and the only way you guys can actually get it is from the um reserve crates now luckily right now um if you log on to call of duty um, a few updates ago i believe it was the 1.16 update if you log on since that update you actually get a free reserve crate which guarantees you a mark ii weapon and this is how i got that weapon i got it in that crate if you looked at the intro clip that is how i got it so yeah good luck with getting this weapon if you do get it make sure to use it make sure to go ahead and use the attachments that i use once again i use high caliber one i use elo sight or reflex sight as you can see i'm using reflex sight in this clip i'm not quite sure what i prefer i think it might be reflex sight if i'm going to be honest with you guys and i use steady grip and rapid fire and fast mags um scavenger and lightweight and that is the class i recommend this gun tremendously so go ahead and give it a go if you guys have it anyway that has been it for today's video if you guys did enjoy make sure to go ahead and leave a like and a sub and hopefully i'll get to you guys in the next video peace